Welcome to Live 2D Cubism 4 tutorial series, Introduction to Tools and Technical Concepts. My name is Brian, and let's get started. So, to begin this course, I will guide you through the process of getting Live 2D Cubism. Live 2D's installation process is generally simple and painless, but if you get stuck in any part of the following tutorial, Remember that there's always the unofficial user community on Discord to help you out. So let's go to the Live2D official website to download Cubism. The address is www.live2d.com, or you can search Live2D on Google and the first one should be it. If you land it on the Japanese webpage, click on the top left drop down menu to select English or whichever language you prefer. Find your way to the download page. Depending on when you're watching the tutorial, the website's layout may change. As for the current website, we can simply hit this Download Trial Version button or go to Download from the top menu. Before downloading Cubism, let's spend a moment to confirm whether your machine can run Cubism. Here is where you can find about the system requirements. The most common problem that new users fail to install Cubism properly is that they are using the 32-bit windows, but Cubism only works on 64-bit. So make sure that your windows meet the requirements. If you are using a Mac, see the other column. You'd also want at least 4 gigabytes of RAM. If everything looks good to go, we can go on and scroll down. Have a brief look at this agreement. Check the box when you're ready. Then choose download for the first time if this is your first time downloading Cubism. Now my machine, current one, doesn't have a Cubism. So I'll check the download for the first time box. Type in the email and we can get the versions that we need. At the time of this video being recorded, the latest version is 4.0.02. If you have a newer version when you're watching this video, go ahead and get the newest one, should be fine. Or you can click the drop down menu to select the same version that you prefer. Hit download when you're ready. You may already be aware that Cubism has a free version and a pro version. First thing I want you to know that both versions use the same one that we're downloading right now. I know you have a lot of questions about the free and the pro. We'll talk about them in a bit. We do not need to decide them now. Let's focus on completing the installation process first. The downloading process should be ready now. So let's go through the installation process together. Double click the installation pack. And then click next, accept, next. Pick a drive that you want to install it, move on, move on. And that's about it. Let's launch Cubism and see if it works. All right, there you go. If you see the screen, then congratulations, you have successfully installed Cubism and you took your first step to become a professional Live 2D creator. Now back to the question of using free or pro. Live 2D Pro is subscription based. It used to offer a permanent license in the past, some people may have it, but that option has ended since 3.0. Once you purchased a month or more subscription, your account will receive a license key. You can then activate the pro version inside this free version that we installed with your new key. The changes apply automatically upon activating the license key. But you don't have to decide it for now. For this tutorial, using the free version is completely sufficient. I will be demonstrating in the pro version though, mainly because I want to cover the extra tools and functionalities that the pro version has to offer, so that you can know about them too. Let's talk about what the differences are. On the same page where you download the Cubism, you can probably scroll up and find in the top menu a button that says Compare Pro and Free. 
Now here's a page that you can come back later anytime when you decide on buying the Pro. Currently, you haven't even learned anything about the basic of Cubism, so these features listed on the website, they may not even mean anything to you. What I can tell you now in summary is that the Pro version allows you to make bigger and more complex models. More complexity means that more features your model architecture can implement so that the performance is more dynamic and versatile. But you don't really need them in order to make an interesting and creative light 2D model. In fact, I can assure you that even with just a free version, you can make models for a complete visual novel game, a VTuber character, and take on paid commission jobs. The free version does not put a watermark over your work, nor does it stop you from exporting any Live 2D file. Live 2D is just that chill and generous. So put your worries away and proceed with the free version for now. If you're not ready, to make the purchase, but you really want to follow this tutorial with the pro version, well here's the good news, you have 42 days free trial of the pro version. So it is really up to you. If you're not a full-time learner, you will take your time to learn Live 2D and occasionally drift off to do your own project, then reserve your uh, trial version for later and use the free one for now. But to be honest, if you are really focused on this, finish the whole entry level course within 42 days. By the end of it, you'll be ready to take on paid jobs. Then you will let your first job to pay off your pro version subscription. All right, that's all for the first episode. And for the next one, we will talk about texture, polygon, and art mesh. I'll see you guys.